Hello, hello, welcome back to my channel. Oh my gosh, ladies and gentlemen, it's time. It's finally time. And if I can say this in my Dutch own words, blood, sweat and tranen, <laughs> blood, sweat and tears, then my Dutch people know exactly <laughs> what that means. And um, oh my goodness, this this is my, yeah, I don't know, mm -mm -mm. I, mm. where do I start, where do I start, okay, guys, so this is my new project, huge project, took me months, 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 so many hours, so many curses, so many tears, so many happiness, so many, so many joy, so many um, words um, saying, cool, 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 <laughs> Yeah, okay guys, it's finally time to show you my latest project and the papers I designed myself. Yes, I did it. I totally designed these papers myself and I'm very proud of it. And this is so me, this is so close to my heart, so close to my personality and... Um, yeah, let's get into this. <laughs> okay, guys, yes, so I did design my own papers, and that's this big pack. It's huge. These are, this is a set of 48 sheets, 12 double sided, four sheets of each, 190 gram, and it's A4 size, 21 by 29 and a half centimeters. And I designed it myself. So 48 sheets, guys. Yes, 48. And I must say, I used it again. All. Yes, yes, I used it all. All right. But let me show you the project. What did I make with that? Okay, so first of all, the measurements. You might like to know how big this is. Is this my biggest album? Well, I don't think... I don't think I ever made a bigger one than a an A4 size, and this is even bigger. bigger. Uh, okay, so let's see. It's a 11 3 fourths of an inch. That means that it is a 30 centimeters, and then this size is an eight and a half. That means that it's 21 and a half centimeters, and the spine is. Um, yeah, I did cut a 4 inch spine, but with all the decoration and everything, it's, it's a 4 one fourth. And that means that's a 10 or an 11 centimeters of a spine. So yeah, that is pretty huge. Alright, but I love making huge because then you have so much possibilities to make nice pages. And I just love making nice activity pages i love it love it it takes hours but oh my gosh i'm so proud of this project so let me first show you the outside okay so here we have the cover Duh. <laughs> all right so yeah i did some uh a little patchwork because the cover is a little bit bigger than the uh a than the A4 papers. So I use this um, layout, this background papers and this decoration. Um, I did add the touch of gold in this project. Uh, normally I would not use that much gold, but I think, yeah, wild heart, it's a little bit wild. It's very romantic. And yeah, I think gold fixed, uh, fit perfect to this. So that's why I choose for gold, for the gold touch. Um, of course, I did use uh, some ribbon uh, to cover up this nice edge. And then I used burlap. I hope you can see it like this. Um, I used some burlap to cover the spine so it will not crack or anything. And then I had some uh, chipboard left and I thought, oh, why not make some nice decoration extra with it. So this is an extra piece of chipboard. And then I... Uh, put some uh, leopard papers behind it for just a little edge and then I use this nice lady and some brads to hold it down a little bit better 
and then we go to the side to the back <laughs> to the back and here I use this papers and the same layout as the front only this paper is different okay now let's go inside as you can see <laughs> the front cover just fit in my camera frame so oh my gosh I hope I can show you it all let's go inside guys all right so let's open this up and as you can see right away it lays pretty nice flat with that extra half inch gusset that I like to use for um, adding the pages so this is how it looks when you open uh, the album but first let me go to the first page okay so um, the front and back page I split in two and um, first things first of course the first thing you will see is this um, ribbon that you can untie it and then you can open this up and then we have a nice box uh, well nice box it's a nice storage place where I added some leftover pieces and all the cutouts that I have still left and this is um, that that accordion thickness so it has quite a depth in here so you can add loads and loads as you can see things in here or photos that maybe does not fit um, anywhere but I don't think so because there are so many spots to put your photos on but I thought it would, was a good idea I think it, it is a good idea to add all my leftover pieces in this box so the person who gets this can still use them maybe glue down in the corner for, add a picture or something so that's why I added that and then this closes up back and then I'm just gonna grab these two strings and then I'm just going to make another nice bow. I added two leaf charms at the end of this to bring back that golden touch. I really love this one. And then we go to the next one. Now this one, um, yeah, let me just open it up. Okay, so here we have a nice um, booklet and it's a little note notebook where you can add um, where you can write something down of course and then at the back there is a nice pocket where you can add also uh, things in there but this is a closure and when you open this up one at the bottom one at the top and again I used uh, some leftover pieces I always do that <laughs> <laughs> I can't help it. it, it's really an addiction. Alright, and then you will see two nice tuck spots. One here and one here. Just a simple tuck spot, it's not actually a pocket, but it's, it's yeah, it is. <laughs> and then when you open this up, you will have, I believe, nine pages where you can add a nice picture uh, on for the left and the back. Uh, the left and the right so I did not add any papers on here because I really believe if you add your pictures on then it fits perfectly but if I added already some photo mats on it then there would be now no much not much place for that to do so I kept it plain but you can add I think there are nine pages one two three four five six seven eight nine nine pages um, double two so you get 18 uh, photographs and 18 right here so 36 pages nice little pictures you can add in here and then this is the closure just like that keeps it all in place and that's only the cover inside do you like it <laughs> then let's go to the next page before I go to the next page, uh, if you want to know what kind of um, how I made the curves during all this uh, all these pages, um, I did use this template. Um, so you can use two shapes. I use this shape for this box, uh, this the storage box. Let me call it the storage box. And this shape you will see more and more uh, during this. Uh, album for pockets or 
all kind of flaps and things. So I used just this template. This is a little chipboard piece that I used and um, I cut it out of course from more dye. I have no idea which brand it is because I bought it years, years, years ago from a craft fair. I have no idea, but I cut it out. I cut it out uh, to use it as a template. All right, let's go to the next page. Now this page. Um, all right, let's see how this page works. Well, the first thing that I see is right here, a big pocket. I added just some white photo mats on, so you still can add a nice photo, photo, photos, loads of places. Then you will see right here this one, and then this opens magnetic to the left and to the right, so you have a nice photo spot. Then this is a pocket where I added two photo frames on it. And then this flips down, which I, uh, oh my gosh, let me see if I can show you that. And I have to turn this this way. Can you see this? This is a nice little, um, yeah, again, some leftover frame, which I love to make. You can use this to write something down, or you still can add a nice picture here below or over the top here. That's totally fine with you. Um, for these, these are no stamps. Yeah, those are just some vellum sheets, which I used in gold and in black doing this album. Um, can I show you? No, that, that, those are just vellum sheets, see-through um, quotes. Then we have a nice little pocket right here, which I added just two nice writable um, tags, cards in here. And then I have to close this, it makes it a little bit easier. Then this flips to the right. And here I made another nice leftover frame um, photo mat. And again here also love, live and love to the fullest. This, these are some gold, gold shiny quote. But th those are all vellum, vellum pieces. Okay, and then, of course, here you also can add a nice picture. Then it's still not done, because this one flips to the left. And here, I, that was just a big, 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 big photo collage. No, it's not a photo collage, it's just I added a big sheet of my papers in it. How that sounds, my papers. <laughs> I really love this, this, this layout. And then... We have two pockets right here, and I added two nice booklets, but I did not put anything inside. You can write in there. You even can add some uh, white plain pages in in, in, instead of just keep this plain, so you can make also a writable notebook with it. But I kept it plain because I have no idea what the person who gets this wants with it. All right, and then you close this down, and then I'm just going to open this up for the closure, and that holds it all together. Okay, now in each page, there are three, by the way. Yep, only three. <laughs> and I'm still using 48 sheets. Okay. <laughs> all right, then in each page, there is a large tag, which you can pull. It's, it's a really big, large tag. Uh, the fronts are decorated. And the back is just a nice big white sheet um, for, yeah, you can write something down, a nice, nice letter, or you can put your photos on, of course. Oh, and I add a nice golden touch leaf on here. I really like this hanging on the outside. Super, super cool. All right, let's go to the next page. <laughs> All right, so the next page is a little flatter, I thought, hmm. but in the end, it's quite thick all, uh, already. Okay, so what we have here is, let me open up this first. I used this super cute, super, super cute, a little, um, I call this, oh my gosh. Yeah, I know the word in Dutch, but not in, in English. Love, love this. It's a quasha. 
but anyway and this golden leopard right here super 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 cute and then um, on top you can add and um, do I have something you can add your picture in here if you like you can pull it out but for now I just did not put anything inside but as you can see you can add your picture inside so it's a nice clear pocket then you open this up and then you have four places of a nice small photo to put on then where do we start um, let me start first here now these are the tags that I had uh, in that I made a nice writable note tags but you also can pull all of these out so that is a nice card for adding a picture or writing something inside totally up to you I do love to write something here and add a nice picture in here love that all right and then there is still a big pocket behind it and I made it I made this a nice writable notebook just a small one but not too many pages but still very useful and then at the back we have another pocket where you can add still a nice picture on the back or you can write something down super cool isn't it I just love it Alright, and then of course you can add all these nice cards. They are cards, not tags. You can put these all back inside. You even can put these all just inside, but I really like have this flippable. Like this, I really like it. It's just yeah, something else, something different. Alright, and then this, you can close it down with this nice big white thread. Super cool, isn't it? I love it. So, so cool. Okay, let's go to the next page. <laughs> and then we go to the next page. And this page, yeah, I don't know. I <laughs> This took me forever, but I, yeah, I... I'm gonna show you guys. I'm just gonna show you. I really love this. How this turns out is just love it. <laughs> okay, first of all, you'll see this square piece. Now you can take all these out and you can write your little secret message inside. But that's not all because these you also can pull out. Can you imagine? Put here a nice little picture on here and write something on the back even a nice I call a nice little portrait photo love it absolutely cool then you just put these back very easy to use these little guys super cool isn't it oh only this I also love okay then this is movable so you slide this to the right, then you can open this to the left, and you still have a nice picture frame right here. And I'm going to move this a little back, otherwise I can't open this. Okay, let's open this to the right. Then you will see a nice big pocket, where I added a nice leftover page. And it's a booklet, but you still can add some white pages in here, you can add your pictures in here. So many possibilities to do, or you can still add your pictures of course in this big pocket then this flips up and here I made again a nice leftover frame photo mat spot <laughs> that says forever and that's still not done guys nope 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 it's still not done I'm just gonna <laughs> move back inside now here you have a nice spot also for photos if you like then this opens up and now on the left side, I have to move this. On the left side, there is a nice big pocket with a tag inside or a booklet. No, this is just a tag. And here it said, follow your dreams. Super cool. And then on the right side, 
there is also a nice big pocket and here said with all my heart so fancy I really love it and then on the inside there is a um, a waterfall all right so did not decorate in the inside otherwise you have no room for placing your photos so I just added this little strip at the bottom love that so I don't want to see any empty spots but sometimes you must all right and then you just have a little pocket at the bottom where you can still add a little secret or a little note and then put this all back inside yep here we go and then you flip this all back this back this back this and then I'm gonna move it to the right put this on its place and then I'm just going to move this back do you like it? I am so proud of this page I love 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 how this turns out super cool and then of course we still have a nice big tag on the inside and the back is plain oh my gosh love it super cool Oh, wait. Here yeah, I added also a nice leopard charm on it. To bring back the gold. Bring it back. Alright, let's go to the next page. <laughs> okay, guys. Now, this page, I call it the stationary page. And you will see in a minute why I call it that way. Um, okay, so this opens magnetic to the left. Nice small spots which you don't see. Wait just a sec. Nice four little spots where you can add a nice photo. Then this moves here, and then I hope you can see that a little bit. See that's that's a little yeah, I did some pop-up. Yay! <laughs> And here I just added some um, nice little A4 tags inside and two little note cards inside. But it's super cute that this is standing up. I really like it. So as you can see, yeah, it goes up. I hope you can see that. It's super, super cool how this looks. See, it's pretty easy to do, but yeah, you have to just... And I'm not that kind of a girl for the pop-up, but I really like this one. Um, and then we have a little pocket. It's such romantic papers. It is a walk in nature walks the soul back home. Or, and so the adventure begins. It's super cool. All right, so this is the pocket. And then when you open this one up, then here uh, on the right side also a nice spot for photos. But this is a nice book which you also can remove it. And then on the back, oh my gosh, I did not know that there was a pocket in a little tuck spot right here. So I totally forgot to add something in. I have an empty spot. Oh, ooh, okay. I do have an empty spot. Yeah, a little secret spot. All right, so this is a nice notepad which you can use uh, you even can pull it out as you can see i really like it leftover pieces yeah i'm the queen of leftover pieces <laughs> okay and then you put this all back Ta -da! love it super super cool oh my goodness let's go to the next page <laughs> Okay, let's go to the next page. Here we see a little string that you can open this up. You always can add a little picture on these little flaps, but these are the closures to hold everything down. Then I see two big pockets. Nice place for adding pictures in or on. And then this opens up to the right. And uh, yes, I made a little pop-up again. Super cool, as you can see. And then on the back, there is 
two nice pockets on the back spleen, which you can still add your pictures on. Super cool. And what do you think about all these nice little spots for a nice little picture? Perfect. I love it. Super cool. And this is the same thing. Yay! <laughs> So yes, I did some pop-up. You asked me to do some pop-up pages, but I yeah, I'm not that inventive or but what I don't like to make, I, I don't. So but this I really like. This is so cool. Yeah, I can imagine that you put a nice little picture on here. Maybe you can write something down here. Super cool. Love it. Super and easy to do also. It's not that difficult, guys. It's not. It's not. And I'm going to show you in the tutorials. Yes, I am. Let's go to the next page. One thing. It's a shame that such a page takes so many hours to make. And I'm just going to show you, to show you all in one minute. <clears throat> I don't like it. <laughs> oh, and of course, of course there is a big insert on here. And here's also a little charm. Super cool. Super nice. Okay, put that back. And then we go to the last. Oh no, it's of course not the last page. Well, almost. Then we have a little pocket page to keep it a little more flat. Um, so we have a little pocket down here, which you still can add your pictures in, of course. Just a little small pocket. And two booklets. Super cool, very easy to make, and I'm going to show you everything during tutorials, and then a nice booklet. Love what you do. I always say that guys, love what you do. Yes, don't do anything that you don't love to do. Alright, the lesson for the day. <laughs> okay, and then this one flips up magnetic, and I gave it also a nice golden touch. So if you can see, it's not too many gold, but just a little, just a little, little tiny touch in the embellishments. Okay, I open this up. I did some decoration right here at the top. Super cool. And then this is a little expandable pocket. Let me move this up. See, just a little expandable pocket where I added nice little photo spots. Already, oh, there's a third one. So a nice thing to add your little pictures on. Yeah, okay, let's go to the next. And this is the last page, the inside cover page. Let's open this up with this thread. So this is the closure, but you still can add a little picture. This is the closure, let's open this up. And then this flips to the left. Photo mats, photo mats, photo mats. And then this side also, I just collaged some white papers and it looks very plain, <laughs> but it's just a flip out extra page for extra photos. And then inside two nice tags. All right, let's put this back, back up, wait just a minute, flip this back, back this way. Yes. Okay, let me tie the closure back for you guys. And then we have the final last item. Is it an item or oh, I think it is. All right, so that's a big pocket. Just a nice big pocket. Uh, but look at this. This is so cute. Look at this. Do you see this? There's this little elephant. Oh my gosh, it's super cute. It's so darn cute. Um, then you open this up and then this is also a nice expandable big, big pocket. A see-through pocket where you can add also so many things in here. Um, for the photos maybe where you don't have any place for that. You still can add loads of things in here. Okay guys, that's it. Oh my gosh, we are already ready. So what do you say? Look at this. Wait just a sec. The side, the look of this. So 
let's say yeah, that you have this on your uh, dressoir or something. Look at the side. The size of these little charms right here. Oh, it's so cool. I love it. Super cool. I'm so proud of this. I can't... It, yeah. My daughter just told me a minute ago, Mom, do you take drugs or something? Because you are so hyper. <laughs> and wild. And oh my gosh. <laughs> well, that is, I believe, the, adre the adrenaline that um, I finished it up finally today. And, um, and it's not that I'm happy that I finished it because I did not like it. Because... I'm so so anxious to show you all this with my, my with my own papers. I just want to know what you think about it. I want to know what you think about this this project that I made with all my love and all my passion. And this is all me, guys. I did my best, and I am so proud of this. Um, yeah, I really can say I am proud of this. Um, now this is the end result and why it took so long um, I also I always not always but sometimes I do especially when I'm gonna do some pages that I never did before I do like to make a, uh, a tryout so for those who think why does it take that long well this is my tryout <laughs> Yes, it's exactly the same one, exactly the same, but then with black. As you can see, this is with black cardstock and this is with grey cardstock. So because I could not choose which cardstock I prefer using. And if I may choose the cardstock which I prefer the most, the beautiful where the paper is really get his uh, most beautiful pop up for the pages I really think the, 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 the gray pages but for those who like to have black yep that's 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 a plus too it really is it really looks good in black too I'm just gonna open this up to show you real quick if you're gonna watch the tutorials then you're gonna see the black album perfectly too but I'm not gonna show you the insides as you can see, this was my tryout, but I fixed. I did not like it because I did not have a closure for this one. And then this is exactly the same. Really like it, how it all turns out. Here is the stationary page. And here is that page for the pop-ups. And here is that little pocket page with the golden touch. And here is the last page. So as you can see, it's exactly the same, but then with black. So yeah, which one do you like? You can choose anything you like, of course. But that is why it took so long. <laughs> I made a tryout. Yeah, I did. So oh my god, it took me hours. Yeah, I'm gonna, not gonna explain that much. But yes, 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 I made two, two albums, <laughs> and they are large. They are so, so large and heavy and oh my goodness, but I love it. I, it's super cool. Okay guys, so one more time. Um, I made this with my own papers. It's available. Um, just click on the link below my video. I will explain everything, um, but it's personal, personal contact contact to, to get this. So it's really a limited edition. I do not have... A complete uh, storage room for uh, against the rooftop. Nope, it's really a limited edition. So if I if I'm running out, I'm not gonna get any more. So, but but there is also a printable for this one. So no worries. Um, I did use all 48 sheets. I did. Every single page is used. Um, but I must confess, with the black one, the tryout, I was sometimes happy that I could use, a, if, if I messed it up, then I just grabbed a printable <coughs> to fix it, to get uh, back in the same amount of papers. So I was glad that I had a printable to, if I did cut something wrong, then I could print out uh, from the printable set. So maybe it's a good idea to get the printable set too. But... 
the colors and yeah maybe i don't know what your printer is, is is looking like or what printer you have but my printer prints prints these uh prints just a little lighter than the original i really can recommend that you get the original papers they are so gorgeous absolutely the colors are amazing and yeah but don't wait too long guys because out is out so contact me through facebook messenger through con uh, through my email through youtube see how you get to contact with me because there are plenty 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 of ways even through instagram but instagram is not that much that i do with but you will get them if you like them okay guys give me a big thumbs up if you like this project and i will see you um doing the tutorials i hope you do i hope you would like to join me doing the tutorials uh, we do a lot lots lots of chit chats with everything that's going on in my life that's going on in my mind so if you like to join me then please do there is no uh, list of measurements or a cutting list or material list nope i don't work that way i'm just gonna put my camera on and i'm just gonna start uh, filming and i will give you all the information during those videos um so yeah please join the tutorials if you like to make this project cool bye bye see you next time Thank you.